I needed to buy a home. With four kids at home, I knew an apartment just wouldn't work. But I'm a woman and single. Who would sell a home to me? I was stuck. Hey, how you doing? I've been looking for you. Are you looking to buy a home? Are you a woman? Are you divorced? If the answer is yes, then I'm here to sell you a home come hell or high water. The name? It's Paul Reynolds. And I'm damn glad to meet you. But now, thanks to 22nd Gold Real Estate and Paul Reynolds, I own my very own home. All by my woman self. Come on down to 22nd Gold. And I'll get you into a home that fits nice and tight. And maybe later, you invite me over for a little wine. I won't say no. Mmm, tasty grapes. That's Paul Reynolds. Carlos Santiago. Thought you should know that you've got trouble coming your way soon. Thank you, Big Bill Person. I will be waiting for him. So what are we doing here exactly? Mr. Lou said that Carlos Santiago has cocaine coming into this marina on a daily basis. If my hunch is right, this is the one we've been waiting for. The largest amount of coke in U.S. history. Ah, it is a nice night, is it not? Mm -hmm. Moonlight, ships. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sit right here and we're gonna take it. Be like taking candy from a baby. No, it isn't. It's gonna be really, really hard. You know, your attitude is really crappy tonight. Trust me, it's gonna be simple. Brett Dangerous, so nice to finally meet you. We heard you were coming. Who the dick are you? My name's Johnny. It, I'm, I'm sorry, why, why are you still whispering? Because I'm a man, goddammit. Can you stop it? It's weird. No thanks, jerk. Oh yeah? Well, how about I hit you in the temple with my gun? Congratulations, Brad Ingress. You found my cocaine. No, I thought I was going to have to torture you to get the information. But, but, as it turns out, your sturdy little pup offered it up without a fight. Didn't she, John? I told them everything. I thought you were dead. Great. Oh, yeah, she talked. And much, much more. <laughs> I mean, I guess a girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do. Ain't that right, Dangerous? I'm talking about sex. Look at my penis. Shut up, John! Okay. You see, Big Bill called me and told me you were coming. And he told me that you are a cop. And that made me angry. But when she told me, you are also working for my competitor, Mr. Lou. That made me happy. Do you know why Brett Dangerous? No. I bet you're gonna tell me. I'll tell you why. Because now I can kill you and Mr. Lou in the same day. As you might say, I am killing two jerks. Sorry. Two jerks with one stone. Your mom's a stone. You shut your mouth! Hey, Carlos, I got a little idea. Why don't you let me down? And the four of us go to town on that mound of powder over there. Then afterwards, we'll all go kill Mr. Lou. I have a better idea. The three of us are going to go to my room and make a porno on my water bed. No! 
I demand you let us go. You are in a position to demand nothing. I am in a position to grant everything. Get this stink out of here. Let's go. Oi. Take her to my mansion and bring the Kokania too. I will be there taking a nap on my order bed. Right. Okay. Wait right here. I'm never gonna get away with this. Oh, really? Really. So where are you from originally? Shut up. I'm just asking. Now, I want you to take him within an inch of his life. Then, I want you to drive him out to the desert and have him bury alive. Bury alive. Don't worry, Velvet. I'll be out of here in seconds. You hear me, Carlos? No one can hold me down. I'll send you to hell in 10 minutes. I was in Vietnam, goddammit! or something, so I guess out of principle, I have to kill you. So, here we go. Whoa. Let's just talk about this, all right, man? You're the boss and all, all right? Looks like you've fallen on hard times. 